Welcome everybody to Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Let me get the lights for us, shall I? Now that the atmosphere is severely spooky, let's get started. Night one. I don't believe uh, that. I'm here to talk you through some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here and to help you get started down mm -hmm. this new and exciting career path. Uh, now, I want you to forget anything you may have heard about the old locations, you know. Uh, some people still have a somewhat negative impression of the company. Uh, that old restaurant was kind of left to rot for quite a while, but uh, I want to reassure you, Badbury Entertainment is committed to family fun and above all, safety. They've spent a small fortune on these new animatronics. Uh, facial recognition, advanced mobility. They even let them walk around during the day. <laughs> Isn't that neat? No, not but really. But most importantly, they're all tied into some kind of criminal database so they can detect a predator a mile away. Oh, great, so I'm in trouble. To guard you. Uh, now, that being said, no new system is without its kinks. Uh, mm -hmm. You're only the second guard to work at that location. Uh, the first guy finished his week, but complained about conditions. Uh, we I would complain about conditions, shift. too. So, hey, lucky you, right? No. Uh, mainly, he expressed concern that certain characters seemed to move around at night and even attempted to get into his office. Uh -huh. Now, from what we know, that should be impossible. Uh, that restaurant should be the safest place on Earth. So, while our engineers don't really have an explanation for this, the working theory is that... The robots were never given a proper night mode, so when it gets quiet, they think they're in the wrong room. So then Highly they go suspicious. try to find where the people are, and in this case, that's your office. So our temporary solution is this. There's a music box over by the prize counter, and it's rigged to be wound up remotely. So just every once in a while, switch over to the prize There's a counter bug in video here. feed and wind it up for a few seconds. It doesn't seem to affect all of the animatronics, but it does affect one of them. Mm. Uh, this and as for the rest of them, we have an even easier solution. I feel like you it's see, not easy. There may be a minor glitch in the system, something about the robot thing you was an endoskeleton without a costume on and wanting to stuff you in the suit. So, mm -hmm. hey, we've given you an oh. empty Freddy Fazbear head. Uh -huh. Problem solved. No. You can put it on any time and leave it on for as long as you want. But my hand. Eventually, hand. anything that wandered in will wander back out. Uh, something else worth mentioning is kind of the quirky modern design of the building. You may have noticed there are no doors for you to close. Mm -hmm. uh, but hey, you have a light, and yeah. even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building cannot. So don't worry about the place going dark. Oh, I see my flashlight well, I think thing now. Said, uh, you should be golden. Uh, check the light, put on the Freddy head if you need to. Uh, keep the music box wound up. Piece of cake. Oh, okay, yes. Now, piece of cake, Mr. Phone Guy, who's dead. I hear, though, the series about this game, and I'd rather not care to hear them. Sugar Song talks about them all the time, and it's very annoying. So keep your theories to yourself. I'd rather not care. Oh, goody. Chica's gone. And so is Bonnie. If that is a name sound. Hello, Bonnie. You're coming to visit me? Oh, how nice of you. Hello there. 
cheeky little bunny. Oh, hello. Should I be concerned about you? I'm doing this right. I don't know. I feel like he's not big concerned right now. He's like way over there. come to play. Wait, she get You look different. Oh. Easy peasy. I need to take this one. Unlike this room, there's no fan going on right now. For your viewer pleasure. Okay, night one, easy peasy. What can I say? I'm just that good. Hello, guess. Uh, hello. You've hello. gotten sugar free uh, here. Yeah, I told you your first night wouldn't be a problem. You're a natural. Yeah. Thanks, uh, you know, I'm sure you've done this before. The older models sitting in the back room. Oh no, uh, I haven't been paying attention. We just use them for parts now. Mm -hmm. The idea at first was to repair them. Uh, oh. They even started retrofitting them with some of the newer technology. But they were just so that ugly, sounds you know? like a great idea. Smell. Where are uh, these guys? Uh, so I guess they decided to just go in a whole new direction and make them super kid friendly. Oh, right uh, there. Those older ones shouldn't be able to walk around. But if they do, the whole Freddy head trick should work on them too, so mm -hmm. whatever. Uh, I love those old characters. Uh, did you ever see Foxy the Pirate? Actually, oh, wait, he never came into oh, my yeah, room. Oh yeah, Foxy. Uh, hey listen, uh, that one was always a bit twitchy. Uh, I'm not sure if the Freddy head trick will work on Foxy. Uh, if for some Fantastic. reason he activates during the night, What is it? Thinking, and it can go anywhere. Hmm. Uh, I don't think the Freddy mask will fool it, so just don't forget the music box. Got it. Um, anyway, that? I'm sure it won't be a problem. Uh, have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Hello? Child? Oh. I hear footsteps. I 
heard a child laughter. Hmm. Okay. So far, so good. I don't know what that thing is. As a slash it, I don't know what else to do for that. Oh, hi, Bonnie. You're there, quick. was in my room. What was I supposed to do? Oh, what's this now? Oh, I think I've heard of this. It's the lore. Am I supposed to follow you, Mr. Ghosty Goo? Spelling something, but I don't care about the lore. Okay, this time that stupid little buckle is not gonna get into my room ever again. I thought I was putting on the mask enough, apparently not. Da, 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 da. Go to sleep, your little heads. 
Don't you wake up and kill me. Or I might beat you in the head. That's a good little song I just wrote. Or I should say made up but just out of the willy nillyness of my brain. I don't know if this is like helping to flash them. <laughs> Wind up the little music box. Don't wake up the baby. Or pop it to or whatever it is. This is when the phone guys, like, long ass phone call will be going right now. up really quick. Hello, Bon Bon. Chica, you're on your way. Oh, you're right there, never mind. Okay, good timing, I guess.
Well, I couldn't do anything anyways because Balloon Boy was in there. How am I supposed to combat Balloon Boy? Dang it. I knew that this one was going to be the tough one. Maybe the key is just to stay there and then wait for them to come down these hallways because it seems like that might be the strategy. And if I can't get this um, in this video, I'll have to cut out to where I died. anything to happen now I know that this is when the phone guy is going to be talking anyways but when it's when you die over and over again it's kind of a long night I wonder how close I was that time. Chica and all of them are gone now, and that means Balloon Boy is on the move. Somebody is coming in the vents. Probably frickin' Bonnie. Yep, there he is. supposed to do about that.
Hey, Balloon Boy went away. Somehow. goes away. Gonna screw me over. <laughs> yes, yes, good, 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 good. We made it. Yeah! Of course, we made it. Look at that. Oh, this again. I don't know if you watched me in the intro sequence here, but this. Oh, now they're looking at me. Great. Hello. Well, night three will just have to wait until next time. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys next time. No, I don't even want to hear it. Alright, bye everybody. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon so you won't miss out on Halloween goodness. Also, there will still be live streams at 6pm Central Time. See you there.